Well, hello everybody, and welcome to today's show of Let's Talk in English here on PTS and on the radio. My name is Gabe, and my name is Andrea, and today is Friday, and today we are on the go. On the go, and today we are at a hot pot place. Well, before we can get into the lesson, let's look at today's key words. The first one is buffet. Buffet. You can choose your own food from the buffet. Our next keyword is slice. Slice. I want to make a sandwich. I need two slices of bread. Boil. Boil. Can you boil some water? I want to make tea. Stir. Stir. Kenny stirred the soup because it was too hot. Bowl. Bowl. There are five apples in the bowl. Sauce. Sauce. The sauce is spicy. Don't use too much in the dish. Well, we're going to say these keywords together again. Are you ready? Yes. The first one is buffet. Buffet. Slice. Slice. Boil. Boil. Stir. Stir. Bowl. Bowl. Sauce. Sauce. Okay, everybody, listen up for these key words in today's lesson. And now it's time for us to find out today's mission. Eddie. Ah, Eddie, are you okay? What's wrong? I I just had some spicy sauce. Ah. I love oh, spicy sauce. Oh, I like spicy sauce But too. Eddie, you don't like spicy sauce? I need some water. Ah, oh, right. Well, well, we'll get that for you yeah. in a minute. Can First, we have today's mission? Today's mission. Okay. Today's mission. What is in the table? What is in the table? See if you can find the answer to today's mission in today's lesson. Let's go there now. Ah, oh, Burr. It is cold today. Oh, hello, everyone. It's good to see you. Today, I'm going to eat hot food. In a pot, a hot pot, and Andrea will teach us all about it. So let's go on the go. Today we are at a hot pot restaurant. Many years ago in northern China, hot pot was a favorite meal during the winter. It is the perfect meal to warm you up, and it's really good. Hi, Andrea. I brought some friends to eat with us. Hi, everyone. Welcome to our hot pot dinner. So, Andrea, where is the menu? You don't need a menu at this restaurant.、Mm -hmm. The food is served buffet style.、Oh. The buffet has many kinds of food. Customers choose different kinds of meat and vegetables. They put the food on a plate. And then bring it back to their table. Oh, what did you get? Is that tofu? I don't like tofu. I like to eat healthy food, and tofu is healthy and delicious. You know, you can get a lot of healthy foods at a hot pot restaurant. Well, I like meat, lots of meat.、Oh. You can choose from different kinds of meat: beef, chicken, and lamb. They are cut into thin slices so they cook faster. There are also many kinds of vegetables like cabbage, tomatoes, mushrooms, and more. Wait a minute! Our food is raw. How are we going to eat this? <laughs> Daniel, that's the fun part of hot pot. You get to cook your own food. What? I get to cook my own food? 
I can't cook. Yes, you can. It's so easy. The tables in hot pot restaurants have stoves in them. These stoves boil the soup in the pot. Once the soup is boiling, you can begin cooking the food. So I put the food in the pot like this. Yep. Hey, this is pretty easy and fun. Okay. How long do I need to wait until the food is ready to eat? Well, you have to let it cook for a few minutes. Remember to stir the soup. That way the food cooks faster. Well, good news everyone. We found the answer to today's mission in this part of our On The Go. The question is, what is in the tables? What is in the tables? Stoves are in the tables. The stoves are very important because they boil the soup, and when you boil the soup, you're ready to put food inside. That's right. At a hot pot, you put the food inside of these stoves, and it warms the food up. And you might put slices of meat in your pot. Let's learn our keyword here. It is slice. Slice. Now, a slice of something is a small part of it. Maybe you have a big loaf of bread, but you just want a small piece of bread. Then you can take a slice of bread. And when I'm eating a hamburger, I like to have a couple of slices of tomato. Not a whole tomato, just a couple slices on my hamburger. Well, at a hot pot restaurant, the slices of meat are very thin. That makes them easier to cook. That means they will boil faster. Our next keyword is boil. Boil. Now, when you boil something, you make it very, very hot. When you boil water, it gets very hot. You might even see some bubbles. That's right. You see bubbles in boiling water, and you see steam coming out of the water. That's how you know it is boiling. And when the soup is boiling, it's important to stir it. And that keyword is important to learn. Stir. Stir. Now, when you stir something, like when you stir soup, you move it all around the pot. And when you are making a cake, I love cakes, you need to <laughs> stir everything inside before you heat it up in the oven. A hot pot meal is a good time for people to talk and cook. Hot pot is not a meal that you can eat quickly. It's an experience. Enjoying hot pot means time with family and friends. I think my food is ready to eat. What do I do now? Now you can take out your food with your chopsticks or with a serving spoon. You take the food and you put it in your bowl. Hmm. Yeah. Now, you can also dip your food in some sauce. Where is the sauce? Oh, Daniel, come with me. Sauces can have soy sauce, vinegar, and hot peppers. You can make your own sauce just the way you like it. Wow, that is spicy sauce. <laughs> I could use something to drink. Some tea? Oh, over there. Okay. Mmm. This is wonderful. I am really enjoying this dinner. You know, I could eat hot pot every day. Eating hot pot is a warm and friendly meal experience. I'm glad you like it. Now you know why hot pot is such a 
popular experience in Asia. You know what, Daniel? We also get to finish the rest of the soup in the pot. Well, thank you, Andrea, for sharing this great hot pot experience <laughs> with us. See you next time on the, the go. go. Bye-bye. Bye. Okay, you know, my favorite part of the hot pot is just after the meat and the food is finished boiling, and then you take it out and put it in front of you. And usually you put it in what, Andrea? Well, usually you put it in a bowl. A bowl. Well, let's learn this key word. Bowl. Bowl. A bowl is something you use to eat with. You can put your food in a bowl. Usually you put soup or other kinds of water kind of food in a bowl to eat with. So you have your food in your bowl and then you use your chopsticks or a spoon to enjoy your food. Now Andrea, I have a bowl and a plate here and if I want to eat soup, which one would I use? Well, you would use your bowl. I would use my bowl. Yes. You can't really put soup on a plate because it would get all over the place. That's what a bowl is good for. Yes, and if you're at a hot pot restaurant and you want to get some sauce to enjoy your food, you'll also put the sauce in a bowl. You'll put the sauce in a bowl? That's right. Andrea, you just used another key word. The word sauce. Sauce. The sauce is something you use for your food. It's something that you use to make the food taste better or to taste different. It's a sauce. You can put the sauce over your food or you can put the food in your sauce. I love spicy sauce. Oh, spicy sauce is great. So everybody, next time you're at a hot pot, try to use some of these words that you have learned today. Calendar phrase. Okay, so Andrea, guess what? What, Gabe? Today is my pet cat's birthday! Well, uh, Gabe! That's great I news! Know. Let's celebrate! That is a good idea. And another good idea is to look at today's calendar phrase, uh, let's celebrate! Let's celebrate! If you're excited about something and there is something to celebrate about, maybe you want to have a party. You can say, hey! Everybody, let's celebrate! Woo! Let's celebrate with today's calendar phrase. Good idea. Woo! Let's celebrate. Let's celebrate. Hey, John! Let's celebrate. Okay. What are we celebrating? I got a new job. Really? Congratulations! Let's celebrate! Yes, it's my dream job. That's great! Let's celebrate! Okay, let's go out for dinner. I'll pay. Great! Let's celebrate! Let's celebrate. Let's celebrate. Well, hello everybody. It's time for us to review today's lesson with the question of the day. Eddie, are you better now that you've had water? Yeah, I'm doing much better, thank you. Good. Uh, okay, the question of the day. Here it is. What kind of food do you want in your hot pot? What kind of food do you want in your hot pot? I want lots of delicious and healthy food in my hot pot. I want lots of vegetables. Oh, I'm getting hungry. Okay, everybody, thank you for joining us here today on Let's Talk in English. We're on PTS and the radio. We hope you enjoy the rest of your day and have fun. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. More water. Mm -hmm. Oh, he wants more water. Bye -bye.